Welcome to Darlene's Table. Well, I have another recipe, very simple, to use leftover dressing. Uh, in the South, we use cornbread dressing, and we also make what we call salmon patties. So I'm going. This is very similar. So we're going to start with two cups of leftover cornbread dressing. To the dressing, I'm going to add this is leftover turkey. I chopped it very fine. It's one and a quarter cups. I'm going to mix. Let's mix this together with the dressing. All right. I've got four tablespoons of Bisquick baking mix. This will help them to be a little lighter and not dense. Okay. And now I'm going to add, I've just got half a cup of chopped dried cranberries. And I may have to add another egg, we'll see. I'm going to add the mayonnaise, a quarter cup of mayonnaise. And one egg. And I may wind up adding another egg, let's see what happens here. I don't think I'm gonna need it. Nah, that's moist enough. Okay. Now comes the breading. Let me see how these are gonna work just fine. Make nice little patties. So now I'm making these patties and then I'm going to bread them. I'm going to be adding some more to some of these. All right. Now we're going to bread these little cakes. First in the flour. Oh, I made a little mess there, didn't I? Then egg. And now breadcrumbs. Wet hand, dry hand. Okay. Now. You're making a face. <laughs> Put one in. I'm just going to do four at a time. So. This one over a little. Again, what to do with leftover dressing? Well, here's yet another idea gobbler cakes. Mmm. Those are good. And folks, these little cakes are fantastic. I mean, the stuffing bites were good, but these are awesome. Check this out. Now there goes the crunch. I love the crunch. Now if you had some leftover turkey gravy, that really would have been special. I'll remember that next time. Now watch it disappear. Again, with the fork drop. And yes, this recipe is a keeper, and it was easy, which is always a plus for me. I really hope you try this recipe soon and let me know what you think. You will find this recipe on my website, darlenestable.com. So bye for now, God bless, and come back for more goodness right here on Darlene's Table.